Well, today here on How To Wedding, we're joined by Simeon Priest of Equal Parts Cocktail Company. Simeon, thanks for joining us today. Thanks so much for having me. I, I'm really excited to be here. Yeah, so why don't you tell us a little bit about your uh, company? So we are uh, a mobile bartending service. We specialize in any type of private party, wedding, or special event. Uh, we bring the, the bar to you. Uh, we've got a s strong focus on uh, the craft of the cocktail. Um, and we travel with a, a horse trailer that's been converted into a mobile cocktail bar, as well as utilizing other mobile bars or bar existing bars and spaces. Um, and we're very passionate about selling, celebrating people's special days with them through the art of hospitality and craft cocktails. That's great. And what I really love about your guys' company is that you're eco-friendly and also you're friendly with the budget because you guys don't specifically bring the alcohol to the wedding. You have, you have the bride and grooms do that for you. That's right. So we... We provide everything but the alcohol, which actually ends up being a huge savings because our brides and grooms uh, can avoid a large markup on the alcohol. We definitely help with the shopping list. We can even uh, arrange delivery if they don't want to have to burden themselves with that actual task. But but the alcohol is not provided by us, um, which makes it a very budget-friendly way to do signature cocktails. Uh, we provide the fresh citrus juices, all the syrups, all the homemade ingredients, all the non-alcoholic ingredients, as well as the bartenders and the bars themselves but it ends up being a win-win. They get the best quality of bartender and cocktail that, that is available, and, and the price point is right there. All right, awesome. Well, speaking of signature cocktails, that's why we had you on the show here yeah. today, because um, obviously that's kind of your specialty as far as being able to build that signature cocktail. This is something that I'm seeing a lot more at weddings where it's something that's specifically made by the bride and groom to help celebrate their day. So why don't you tell us a little bit about that process when you're working with the bride and groom? Yeah, so for us, once we've got a client that's booked, we um, we have a tasting where they come to the bar and we we discuss their you know, sort of favorite cocktails, why it's their favorite cocktail. It might be based on the flavor. It might be based on, you know, some sort of memory of a, a space and a day and a feeling. Um, and translating that into something special and unique to them is is really an incredible uh, feeling, an incredible thing for us to be able to offer. We we talk with them about their, their favorite flavors, their, you know, what what resonates well with their palate and their style, or even the theme of their wedding color-wise or, or appearance-wise. Um, and it really ends up being a much more special and engaging experience than the common sort of pop and pour style of bartending where you get a spirit and a mixer, um, which is really quite boring. And it's your special day. It's going to last for, you know, four, six, seven hours. It's, it's uh, a one time shot for us to really create something special and, and showcase it to all of your guests. And it's really an extension of your care for your guests when we are treating them all like a guest in your home and serving them something that's special and, and something that you helped create. Awesome. So then going through that process then, so uh, I, I'm a bridal couple and I'm like, okay, we met on a beach and we want, we want a cocktail that um, signifies us meeting on the beach that day. So then what would you kind of say as far as like the process then of like finding a drink that would fit that? Yeah, well, we'd start by probably discussing, you know, some spirits they want to offer. Maybe it was something really tropical like, uh, like rum and pineapples and coconuts and things like that. Um, and maybe it has like a like hint of the salty sea air and we add that into the cocktail with something that has a little salinity to it or a little foam on top that reminds you of the the foam rolling in on the waves um it's really a fun way to dive deep into into the creative process and and like i said it ends up being something so much more special than just just you know a two ingredient mixed mixed drink all right. Awesome. And then what about um, trying to find a pairing if like the, the bride, she really likes a vodka drink and the groom, he's he's a big whiskey guy. How do you kind of pair those together so that um, the party has not only like a unique selection for that, but also that they complement each other? It ends up being a really good way to do the, the menu for the day because out of your 100 to 200 guests, people like a lot of different things. Not everyone's going to want something, you know, whiskey forward and, and not everyone's going to want a vodka based drink. So if we have an offering that's something light and refreshing or maybe vodka based and then something that's a little bit more bold and spirit forward, it ends up being something for everybody. And and they they always sort of go together in the sense that that makes the bar package well rounded. They don't actually have to pair because you'd be drinking them separately from one another. Sure. Awesome. Well, is there anything else in regarding um, the, the signature cocktails or anything that you'd like couples to know as far as being able to like, anything that they should keep in the back of their mind when trying to come up with one? I think, uh, I think honestly, the only thing I like to emphasize towards people is to just have fun with it. And it's, it's your special day. I, I, oftentimes people ask me like, what should I do about this cocktail? And I'll definitely give a valid, you know, my best uh, recommendation, but just remember it's your day. This is what you want to have highlighted is what we're going to highlight. Um, 
And we really focus on the quality of the interaction we're going to have as bartenders with your guests. Hospitality is, you know, deeply ingrained with our with our business model, and we want to bring fresh ingredients, homemade ingredients, environmentally friendly practices. We don't, you know, bring single use plastic cups and just fill the landfill. Everything is composted or recycled, and it ends up being, in my opinion, a really special way to have your wedding day highlighted from a bar's perspective. And the bar is honestly where the majority of people will have more of an interaction with than anywhere else in the event. They're going to talk to the bartender a handful of times and the quality of that, the quality of that, that interaction is very important to us. And, uh, and so the, you know, the bartending side of the event world is something we care deeply about. Awesome. Well, thank you so much, Simeon, for yeah, joining us on the show here today with How To Wedding. What's the best way people can get a hold of you? Um, our website is equalpartsco.com. You can also find us on Instagram and Facebook, Equal Parts Co. Um, and we got phone numbers and email addresses. Any, any which way you find us, I'll be there to answer you. All right. Awesome. Well, thank you so much for joining us on the show. We'll put links down below. And again, Simeon, thank you so much. It's thank been you. great. Thank you.